Hey guys, how are you? David here from TechSocial.com. A while back, I unboxed this little bad boy. It is the Extreme Mac In Charge Duo Dock for iPad, iPhone, and iPod. But first, huge shout out to Connor Turnbull on Twitter for sponsoring his product review. All right, so let's talk about this dock. Judging from the title of this video, I'm pretty sure you can tell Duo means two, obviously, um, meaning this charges two iOS devices at the same time, which I gotta say is not a lifesaver for me and it's a bit dramatic, but I will say I use this thing every single day of my life now. This this charges my iPad and, and my iPhone every single day and I love it. So that's basically the overview. This charges two iOS devices at once. So now let's get into the pros. The first pro is it's a sleek, simple design. It's nothing really overkill. This little thing is obviously here to support the iPad since, well, the iPad is not exactly the lightest device in the world. So it is good that they were smart enough to put a little back support there. This is wide enough to fit some cases on your iOS devices. In the front, I should say. The back is a minor con, is that you cannot have your iPad docked while the case is on it, such as my Cyber Acoustics case on my iPad right here. However, I do have an iPhone 3GS with my iSkin Solo, I believe it is, and it docks just fine with my case on there which is awesome because you know that means I don't have to take my case off every single day since I obviously charge this every single night. All right, so let's talk about the charging itself. I gotta say right off the bat, charging is very, very quick. Now, I gotta be honest, I don't know exact charging times because that's really hard to estimate, but I will say my iPhone 3GS, as far as I can tell, a rough estimate is this definitely charges in less than an hour, which is pretty cool. And of course, this means all of your iOS devices will work on here as long as you have your dock connector. This means it works with the iPad, the iPhone first generation, iPhone 3GS, the iPod Touch, iPod fifth generation, iPod Nano, the fatty, and finally, the brand new iPod Nano with touch screen. And finally, the last pro is not a huge one, but this is, you know, a little feature art feature that I appreciate and that is right here on the very front you can barely see them little dots right there those are LED indicator lights uh, when it's charging of course the phone's ringing while I'm making a video why wouldn't it um, it turns orange anyway when it's charging there's an orange light on the front and when it's finally finished charging it's green which is pretty cool. All right, so now let's talk about the cons. Um, I gotta be honest, there's, there, there are not many cons about this product, but there is one deal breaker for a lot of people watching this video probably. So number one is, this is kind of cheap feeling. This is cheap plastic. Um, this isn't, you know, metal or anything fancy like that with glass or any of those cool um, aesthetics. But I will say, does it really matter? It's a dock, it sits on my shelf in the back of my room. It charges, that's all I really care about. Next up is the back dock is not wide enough for cases, as mentioned earlier. This is very thin. As you can see, this only fits your iPad and only your iPad uh, when it's totally nude. So don't expect to be putting any clothes in your iPad. Of course, when I say clothes, I mean a case. I'm just trying to be funny. And finally, the third con. This is probably a deal breaker for a lot of people. If you look in the back here, what is missing? Yes, that will be the 30-pin dock connector. Now, for my use, this is not a big deal at all because, like I said, if I want to sync my iPhone or, or any iOS device, I simply hook it up via USB to my Mac. Not a huge deal since I use the iPad as its own computer. Um, but if you are looking for a duo dock with a 30-pin dock connector, you are not going to get this on here. But if you're looking for a simple dock charging station, whatever you want to call it, with only AC power, then I got to definitely say get this dock it's awesome I love it however real quick I do have to mention this sells for $59.95 that's definitely not cheap for a dock uh, but if you factor in you're technically charging two iOS devices and you're technically saving money rather than than buying two docks uh, from Apple then you probably are still saving money so that's something to keep in mind and that's about it guys overall great product I loved it the official product link will be below this video if you're um, interested in more information and of course huge thanks to Connor Turnbull on Twitter for sponsoring this uh, product review you can follow him on Twitter right below this video yep there it is you see that link click that give him a follow cool dude and if anybody else is interested in sponsoring product reviews just go to ddefranco.com slash contact that link is also below the video for your convenience. So thanks for watching. Check out my social links below the video. And I will see you guys in my next...
video. I think I'm saying video too much. Peace. Hey guys, welcome back to another review by me, the creative one. Mm, that was a weird intro. Hey guys, how are you? David here from TechSocial.com. A while back, I unboxed the Extreme Mac InCharge Duo Duo Dock. I can never say that. Hey guys, how are you? David here. What the 